What is up my friends? Welcome back to your average gent. It's your boy Evan. We are living in a world of great turmoil and uncertainty right now, especially with this global pandemic going on where everything seems out of control and a little bit crazy. And you might be freaking out and be like, oh no, everything is changing so fast. I don't know what to do. It seems like I have no control over my steering wheel. But in today's video, my friends, I want to talk about some habits that every man have control over. And these are the habits that every single man needs to be doing every single day, no matter the situation, all year round. Because it is the things that you do every single day that shapes who you are and who you want to be. And strong habits will help you build a strong body and a strong mindset to keep you resilient no matter what life throws at you. And without further ado, my friends, let's begin. Coming at you at number one, and that is to get enough sleep. I know this is probably your favorite one, right? Especially in times of this, it is the perfect time for you to catch up on your sleep. Now, sleep requirements vary from person to person, but most adults need between 7 to 9 hours of sleep every single night to be able to function at our best. A good night's sleep can improve our productivity and concentration throughout the day. Now, I don't have to list down every single benefit of having adequate sleep, but think about it. Even if you think that you can function with little or no sleep, sleep for one night, the next day you'll feel grudgy and you'll feel sluggish and you will probably crash the next day or you'll be super unproductive and the next day will be wasted. So get those 7 to 9 hours of sleep a night, you are gonna function better and your body is gonna thank you for that. Coming at you at number 2, the second habit that every single man needs to be doing every single day and that is to wake up early. I know habit number one is to get enough sleep, but that doesn't give you the reason to sleep in. Habit number two means to go to bed early and wake up early. Sleeping in in the morning would just make you unmotivated and lazy throughout the day. I know many people will be saying, oh no, I, I'm not a morning person, right? I function better at night. Now, everybody can be a night person, right? Nobody likes to wake up early in the morning. Remember back when we are in school, Nobody likes to wake up early for school. Waking up early in the morning is not about being a morning person. It is about conditioning your brain to do what is hard. For me, I'm still not a morning person. I still don't like waking up early in the morning. But it is about the discipline. It is about not giving in to your weakness. It is about mind over body. What is early totally depends on you. Some people wake up at 4, some people wake up at 5. Now, I used to get up at 5.30, 6.30. Nowadays, I get up at 4.30. I have a friend who is super insane. He wakes up at 2.30 in the morning. He probably sleeps at 8. But what I like to recommend is to wake up at least 3 hours before your actual workday starts. That means if your work starts at 9, then wake up before 6. If your work starts at 8, then wake up before 5. Now you might be thinking, so what do I do with those 3 hours? And that brings us to habit number 3 that every man needs to be doing. And that is eat and help healthy meal. Eat your breakfast. I know many of you probably don't have the habits of eating breakfast. It is too troublesome or you don't have time to eat it. If you wake up at least 3 hours before your workday actually starts, then you no longer have any excuse. You probably have heard that the breakfast is the most important meal of the day. You probably have also heard about we should eat our breakfast like a king, eat our lunch like a prince, and eat our dinner like a pauper. Now, in the morning, our body is deprived of food, right? The time between dinner from the previous night to today's morning, which can be around 10 to 12 hours, our body is still constantly burning calories, mind you. Therefore, for breakfast is the meal that jumpstarts our metabolism so it actually helps us burn more calories throughout the day. When you eat breakfast, you're basically telling your brain that hey, we're gonna have plenty of calories throughout the day so don't worry, alright? Now, I wanna add in habit 3.5 real quick and that is to always maintain a healthy diet. What we put inside our body determines how we perform. If you put in crappy food like sugary, deep fried processed food, then your body is gonna perform like crap. But if you put in healthy and natural ingredients like your green leaf veggies, your fruits, your wholemeal greens, then your body is gonna perform like a beast. Moving on to habit number four that every man needs to be doing every single day that is 
to exercise. Can't do this list without talking about exercise. Exercising can be anything, right? It can be going to the gym, going for a run, playing sports, anything that gets your heart pumping. <clears throat> no, watching horror movies and texting your crush doesn't count. No, I know that during this period, we probably won't be able to go to the gym or play sports with our friends, but that doesn't give us the excuse to be lazy and to slack off. Go for a run or climb some stairs if you still can go out of your house. And even if you can't, do some push-ups, sit-ups, burpees, jumping ropes. There are so many indoor exercises that will absolutely kick your ass if you just do a simple YouTube search. Maybe I should do a home workout routine. I'll think about it. On to the fifth habit that every single man needs to be doing every single day. And that is to meditate. Have some quiet and alone time every day to just reflect, to think about stuff. Think about things that are important to you. Nowadays, we are constantly bombarded by these super stimulations on our laptops, on our phones, on the TV. Everything that we see on the internet has one sole purpose. And that is to grab our attention and get our eyes to stick to the screen for as long as possible. Some are good stuff and some are bad stuff. But more than once in a while, we need some time to just zone out, to unplug, to clear our mind, to think deep, to think about our lives. What are we doing? Are the things that we are chasing really hard for are they really worth it? Also, take some time to plan ahead in our mind. What are our goals? Why do we want to achieve them? What is our purpose? Meditate about it. Pray about it. If you believe in God, ask God to reveal it to you. And you will be surprised by the inspirations and the epiphanies that you'll get during this process. On to habit number six that every man needs to be doing every single day and that is to practice gratitude. This is also one of those things that I like to constantly talk about on my channel. Being grateful is something that we need to practice constantly, just like building muscles. The more grateful we are, the more humility that we'll have, and the better we will treat other people. And that is ultimately how we make the world a better place, isn't it? I know that especially at times like this where everybody seems to be afraid, some of you might have lost your job or some of you might even be sick. My heart goes out to all of you who are suffering during this pandemic and I know that being grateful is probably the last thing that you want to think about. But I want to encourage you to think about this, that we are all in this together. You can either choose to focus your finite energy on victimizing yourself and feeling hopeless or you can choose to focus on the things that you do have like your health, your friends, your family and a God that we can rely on. Or you can just simply be grateful that you have a good internet that you can watch this video on. Same situation, one mindset will make you depressed. The other mindset will lighten you up and give you hope. Last but not least, habit number seven that all men needs to be doing every single day, and that is to focus on improving just one thing at a time. I know that by the time you are at habit number seven, you probably have already forgotten about the previous six habits that we have talked about. Now, if you don't believe me, try pausing this video right now and think about what did we talk about? Anyway, even if you do remember, I guarantee that by tomorrow, you probably forget about five of them. If you focus on all the habits all at once, it's gonna be too unsustainable. It's gonna overwhelm you. Wow, Evan, you mean to say that from today onwards, I have to start sleeping eight hours a day, wake up at 5 a.m., cut all unhealthy food, exercise one hour a day, meditate 10 minutes a day, and practice gratitude every single day? I don't know about you, but that sounds like an insane load of work to do, man. And you're right. Chances are, if you're thinking of that, then you're probably not gonna do any of them. You are gonna finish watching this video and you're just gonna forget about it. So my last tip is to just focus on improving one habit today, 
right now. It could be if you haven't exercised in a long time, start by exercising for 10 minutes. If you always like to sleep in until 12 noon, then maybe just start by waking up at 10. And if you have never meditated before, maybe start by meditating 5 minutes a day and think about what you're grateful for. The key is to be consistent and take gradual steps to improve all these six areas of your life. And that is basically it for today's video, the seven habits that every single man can implement today, right now, that will help you build a strong body and a strong mindset. If you found this video helpful, make sure to help your boy out and smash that thumbs up button for the YouTube algorithm. And if you're new to this channel, make sure to click the subscribe button and turn on the notification bell because I will be dropping at least two new dope videos every single week. And you don't want to miss it, man. Once again, my name is Evan. You're watching Your Average Gens and I'll see each and every single one of you in the next video. Bam!